Hey guys, welcome back to our second episode of Tanuki Tea, where we cover what's happening in the social medias inside and outside of Roblox, also known as the Roblox community. Just yesterday, the Pals announced the closure of their YouTube channel. The statement reads about how the channel will not be posting anymore as a group. Many fans are absolutely devastated, and some wonder what will happen to the future of the channel. Many fans took it to themselves to tweet publicly about the situation. Their feelings are quite mixed. Each person has a different take on the situation. The great and amazing news is that the pals will stay friends. There are currently no bad news as of the moment. What will happen? What's everyone else's opinion on the topic? Let's find out and let's get started. Yo, what is up, hashtag nerd squad, and welcome back to another video. Before we get started, thank you so much to this month's Patreon supporters, Bitback Gaming. I'm also very sorry for the delay on this video. I got a new gaming PC. Let's just jump right into the news. To get a better understanding of the situation, let's first comprehend or analyze where it started. The note reads below. Hey everyone, it is with a heavy heart today that we make the announcement that the pals will no longer be posting to this channel as a group and that Dennis, Alex, Sketch, and Sub will be producing their own channels as independent creators. Together, we had an incredible and fun journey, creating more than a thousand gaming videos in the past three years. But even in our break, we have found more time to explore more avenues of creativity. We're still great friends and you can expect us to pop up in each other's videos. We're unbelievably thankful for the love and support from each and every one of you and none of us would be here without you. We cannot wait to see what the future holds. In short, the pals are splitting up, not as friends, but just the channel. Most likely, multiple factors I believe contributed to their disbanding. The first reason I believe that the pals broke up, which is most likely, is that each creator wanted to pursue different interests, which is completely understandable. Some creators want to take their own paths, which is completely okay. I believe this decision was thought over for a long time. If this is the reason, I wish them best in their paths. The second reason I believe is not enough time. The creators seem to be really busy in their main channels. Releasing two videos a day can be quite stressful on a creator. Heck, I can't even try to put out one every two weeks. Sometimes creators need a break from social life or some of them need to cut down. YouTube is a very stressful career that can put someone's mental health and mood down. As such, this could be a possible reason of the disbandment, simply because each creator felt stressed over the workload or the time. So, what's my final outtake on this situation? Well, I believe that it's good that the pals are still staying friends. Overall, I believe that they broke up because of these three reasons, and that's all. Thank you very much for watching my video. I'd appreciate if you would subscribe. See you all in the next video.